Good morning, guys. Welcome to today's video. We're just getting up. It is, oh, I'm not even gonna tell you what time it is. Terrible. Um, uh, we wake up in the morning and then I always do. Oh, come on, Toby. Come on. Don't judge my dog, you guys. You better hurry. Watch how it's done. Okay, watch, watch how it's done. Come in here. He won't come if he sees us standing there. Toby in. Go there. boy. Anyway, don't judge him. He boys wear pink. He wears pink. He needs that sweater. It keeps him nice and warm. It's starting to get cold. He's got so little fat on his little body. So little fat on his body. Yeah. Look at him. He's so fatter cute? than how we got him. Like. Yeah, like he, you guys might think he's skinny, but when we got him, he was a whole heck of a lot skinnier than that. Yeah, he's such a cute boy. He's such I think a he cute has baby. No. Oh, by the way, guys. Um, this sweater is Macy's old sweater. Yeah. From when Macy was a puppy. All right, did you guys see how, who kissed in yesterday's video? <gasps> yes. It was so cute. We are headed to the barn today. I'm excited. It's day for my lesson. Got my riding pants on. We got a new sweater. I oh, got the same oh, sweater as Sophie. We have to do outfit of the day. Oh, okay. Sophie wants to do outfit of the day. Outfit of the day, Sophie. Sophie I is. I like the new look, black and white. With a sock and no sock. Yeah, sock and no sock. <laughs> That's so cute, but she's got her unicorn shirt on today. What color saddle pad are you gonna wear? White, 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 white. Okay. With my white ear bonnet, it's going to be so cute. One thing you guys might not get or understand is that my kids don't pick out like matching clothes ever. The only day that they ever customize their outfits or even give a thought to their outfits are on days when they have riding. Um, because they want to match everything. They want to match their style pads. Gabby actually changed your clothes two times today. This is what she ended up with. Dun, da, da, da. All right. Thank you, magic wands. That's Not amazing. She teleported. Okay, so obviously you're wearing blue today. Yeah. <laughs> what motivated you to choose blue? Uh, I'm gonna try, I'm gonna put an ear bonnet on Storm today. And I have a saddle pad, a diamond blue, a diamond light blue saddle pad with a matching blue on it. And I'm gonna have to tie it down because Storm hates when it flaps up like this. Yeah, so we're gonna try and tie it down today. So you need to bring in an elastic. Yes, he tolerated that for so long. Like when I first got him. <laughs> Cracks herself up. Gabby. Yeah, um, yeah, so it has a matching um, ear bonnet with diamonds on it, so I'm excited for that. It's gonna box, but that's okay. Guys. All right, who do you want to ride today? Stella. How come you don't want to ride Storm? Storm well, is... I don't have to jump. I need a break from jumping. Yeah, we do need a break from jumping, right? And is that okay? Yeah. I had a break from jumping. Now I'm jumping three foot. Yeah, Gabby had a break from jumping, and now she's jumping so far, so high. So that's all that has to happen. You need to go back, start again. I know. I um, want to work on tons and tons and tons of trot poles today. Yeah, and so you're going to do that on Stella? Are you excited to ride Stella? Yeah. We are still in the process of decorating for Christmas. We got some of it done. I'm excited to get it finished today. Um, I got Levi screaming here. Whenever he screams, it's because we're in opposite rooms. So he's like, he can fly. The dude can fly, but he's lazy. He's like, come and get me. Come here. Hey. See what? how he pops his head and he that's wants- what he, That's what he does when yeah, he doesn't want that. to step up. Come on. Yeah. But that's good. At least he doesn't bite. He gives her his head and oh. is like, there he bites. There he bites. Yeah. Yeah. He's come a long way, you guys. He's making friends with the dogs. He loves us he to loves rub his, his head. All right. Are you coming with us or not? Look, see, he's rubbing his stop. head on her. You stop. Oh my God. I know, buddy. I know. Look how affectionate he is. Isn't that you so cute? Up? Then when you step up, he's like, no. 
It's because he's high. You guys know that when uh, birds sit up really high above your head that they think they're the boss of you? Okay, um, and it's not something you're supposed guys. to do, but yeah, we break all the rules, you guys. Gabby's yeah. having tea for breakfast. You know, she's getting older now. She's drinking tea. It's a fruit tree. Does it fruit tea? Does it have caffeine in it? Yes. I don't know. Caffeine makes me like <laughs> Caffeine makes me look drunk. Makes you crazy. Makes I'm having me, my coffee. No, it makes me Sophie's happy having crazy. A, Sophie's having a bagel. Um, Sam takes care of our you our, our Facebook page and he does such a good job of it Like I don't even have to remind him which is a big thing. Okay, so today he has this thing on there and It says which magic potion would you drink blue or red? I choose blue. blue Blue means you can talk with horses and red means that horses will do anything that you ask Okay, so blue means you can talk to horses and red means that they'll do anything that you want ask them want. I want blue because then I can know what Stella needs or what if she's scared of anything. Mm -hmm. so like, yeah. I agree. What do you think? I think I'm doing blue for Storm so I could tell him to do something. And when he says, no, I'm not, then I'll tell him, you better be quiet and shut your mouth and just do it. <laughs> I'm not putting up him sassy. Oh, that's Especially great. With that, that's great. On. Good parenting, mom. Um, I pick blue too because even though a lot of people say I can read my horse, you can read them through their body language and what they do. You can actually know what they're it's saying. It's always, oh, that's always like based on interpretation. Everybody can look at a horse doing one thing and all think the totally different things that it's saying. Like I've seen that for sure on our channel. So I definitely want to know what they think and why they think it because then we can figure out how to find a solution. But except for shows, red would be easier for shows. Since yeah. you're not lazy and yeah. not energetic, just listens to you. Yeah. Red would be really good for shows. Red would be good for shows, but imagine you use blue all the time and you worked for a whole year with your horse and so then you got to a point because you could communicate that your horse did whatever you wanted. No, Storm would sass me. Yeah, Storm would sassy. Sassy like, so, sass, sassy like sassy like Gabby. Anyway, comment below what you guys would choose. Blue, what your horse could, you could speak to your horse and you guys could understand each other. Your horse could speak to you. Or red, your horse does whatever you ask it to do. The girls and I finished our book, like our read aloud book. It's the book that I read to them. What did we just finish? We read one. Uh, it was called Julie of the Wolves. It went with our native studies. And we learned a lot. It was um, based in Nunavik, Canada. And it was so good. I loved it. It was about a girl who got lost in the wilderness of Nunavik. And she became one with the wolves and found her way home to her dad it just had a lot of emotional things in it and it had a lot of learning in it about the landscape of Nunavut and about animals and my kids just loved it but anyway in this day and age I'm so excited that I can just buy a book online today and read it today like five minutes later like it's amazing so I was searching online to find a really good Christmas story and I want it to be about horses to make our Christmas studies really favorable for my kids um, oh. really a really fun experience for my kids and I found uh, Christmas at Saddle Creek and I know we have the first one it's the Saddle Creek series let me know in the comments below if you guys have read any of the Saddle Creek series by Shelley Peterson um, this is the fifth book in the series and I know that we have the very first one, Sundancer. Like, I know we have this book. I just don't know where it is and I can't find it. I'm going to go look. Um, but I'm going to just buy the, the download version. And get this book so that we can read. Actually, for $25 I can get the whole series. I just hate buying books if I don't know if my kids are going to love them because we have to really be able to get into a book. But I think that this one might be good. You can um, read it, read a preview. So I'm going to do that and see. But let me know if you guys have read the Saddle Creek series and if you love them. It's also staged in Canada. So I think that's good for us. She's currently fairy reading ponies. Fairy Ponies and she resisted these books. Sorry. She resisted these books last year. She can read a little higher level than this. And she said, no way last year, but this year, are you loving it? No. What? Yes and no. 
You like, just hate reading all together, don't you? Why is that light on? And Gabby um, likes it. Like two years ago, um, I read that all. Were you in grade series. four? Yeah, you read that whole series in grade four, didn't you? No, it's grade three. I was in grade three. Yeah, grade three, oh, you read that um, series. Oh, and I cannot read the third book of that because it's missing. Oh, we have it. I'll find it. We are headed to the barn, and it is winter, like freezing cold. I told the girls to bring their gloves. Nobody can ever find their gloves. So anyway. Um, I want to tell you guys this story before Gabby comes out. Um, last night we went to a restaurant, like an actual restaurant, not fast food. And they took forever. It was so long. And Gabby actually said at one point, she's like, wait, are they actually cooking the food like from scratch? And we just all started laughing, like hysterically laughing. Because it's terrible that she didn't know that that's what happens. The time of warming up the car is upon us. What did you bring? That's what happened. It's not like I was going to leave. Chocolate cake. Who made that cake? The time is upon us when the kids can start to do all the cooking. I always cook cake. I always make like bagels, eggs. Um, it's true that got, got, Sophie only makes bagels. You make eggs. Yeah. We're supposed to leave like 10 minutes ago, but Gabby was uh, searching up on Instagram because we just finished school before we left. It's 1.30, yeah, sometimes it goes late, sometimes it goes earlier. Because we only started school a lot, like Started 11. late. Um, anyway, Gabby's watching up on Instagram. <laughs> I swear, like you guys have upped your game. Like all the little girls there's on more. Instagram. Edits. All the little girls on Instagram, every morning we wake up, there's all these new edits. Some are like super emotional and beautiful. And some are so funny. Like somebody found this video of Sophie back when she was like four like i don't know six maybe five i don't know she was young anyways um at this little video where sophie where i was asking sophie like were you trotting or were you cantering like i didn't know what any of those things were, were back trotting? then yeah and she was so sassy but she was a little tiny girl you guys got to see it trotting what are you doing i know what do you trot yes i saw you trotting what do you think Anyway, they're super funny. We're eating cake. I'm sorry. <laughs> anyway, I just wanted to say in the month of December, we decided that we are going to do shout outs. We're going to do like three shout outs every single day, and I want to make it super fun. So I'm going to ask a question, and some of them will be hard, some of them will be easy. And whoever, uh, we're going to pick um, people who get the answer right and shout out three of them. So we're going to do that in December to make it super fun, Christmassy month. But yeah. All right. Hi guys. Guys, I do downloaded Heartland, BB and Tina, Pony Club, well, Pony Sitters Club, Me, I, and Me, Santa Claus, and then the Kissing Booth. Yeah, she downloads all those videos. Like, she's nine. She's got it all figured out so that she can download all those videos from Netflix onto her phone. So wherever we go, she can just I can watch, watch them. watch the Kissing Booth. And she's addicted to the Kissing Booth. Right, you guys. Finally, a chance to test the theory if storm will come. We drove in, and Gabby's like, I see storm. He's at the front of the pasture. Stella's at the front, too. <laughs> she called him. He stopped, turned his head toward her, and looked at her, and then turned away. Stay there, though. He's looking. He's like, What's she doing? He's interested, Gabby. Don't go in. Mud no more, you guys. It's rock solid. Hi. Yeah, I have. Hi, handsome. Oh, you're so Hi. pretty. Well, oh, he's coming, Gabby. To stay. He's coming. See? He tries you. No, he wants to come. Yes, you're pretty too. Yeah, that's his best friend. Sure that's his best friend. Stormy. But look. This is the no. problem. <laughs> We're bombarded with chestnuts. He's the marm. Come on, he knows his name. Come on, he's like, should I come and get attacked by these guys? <laughs> this guy. Yeah, I'm going in. I'm going Be careful. Be careful. I never really noticed the other horses. They're, they're beautiful. Hey, buddy. Okay, stand there and make him come. So I think he wants to come, but he's fright. He's scared that he's going to get kicked. He's interested. He's like, I don't know what to do. He's saying, come here, come here. <laughs> come on. Storm, come on. Come on. 
wants to do it, don't take any more steps. Come on. <laughs> He's pawing the ground. <laughs> it's the battle of the wills. Has he come around? Coming around the ice. You're winning, Gabby. <laughs> it's happening. Finally. Uh-oh. Mom, look at their water. The moment of truth, Sophie said. She's looking at us. They know. They know so much. Oh, are you cold, sweetie? It's just a rain sheet on. Come on. Come on, Stella. Come on. Stella. Pull Kara if you come. Come on. No Kara if you don't come. Like, why would she come if she's got food? Stella, you got five million apples if you come. Library. Yeah, she's not coming. Like, <laughs> I just don't see it. Um, I have four pairs of riding breeches now. Four, that's a lot for me. And my very first pair is a Lation brand, and I like them. They kind of like a droopy butt thing going on though, but I like them. My second pair of breeches was um, the same kind of Gabby loves. They're Nova Outfitters, and they're like tight some of, and they're kind of comfy, but I don't love them. Like, they don't look that good on me, so I hardly ever wear them. And then my third pair is another Nova Outfitter pair, and they have the leg things on them, like the sticky stuff. To really make me lift up in the saddles, hold on better, grippy. They're super grippy. And I like those ones. They're like wintry and they, they're just comfy. And then recently I bought another pair and they're carrots and they're winter ones. And they were like the, probably the cheapest out of all the ones that I have. And they are my favorite pants ever. And that's all I wear. But I need to really rethink the whole winter riding thing because I can't ride in this coat. I don't not know what I was thinking. So I guess I'm riding in this sweater and I'm gonna freeze because it's cold in here. We were young and we were free and running Never bothered about what could be coming Every day we danced and life was smiling We were young and drunk in love A few years later I have started thinking If it's just love in every glass I'm drinking We're like one and without you I'm sinking I'm always shining next to you Oh, I got you, there's no reason to Chasing pavement on my own Cause you're here to stay every night and day Sometimes clouds got in our favorite places. But we were young and look up. Click, click, click. Oh, never trying to distract and make him stop. Tap, tap, and you win. Yes. Hand forward and go. Thighs on. Good job, Laura. You didn't stop. That wasn't bad at all. All right, let's do it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. 
Change direction and trot over the poles again. <laughs> Look up, hands forward. Look straight ahead. One, two, three, four, five, six. Spank, 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 spank. That was not you, that was him. Go. He doesn't need to get to be rude. He's going to be rude, he's got to move more. Two. I did my way before. Now look ahead. I need to call you secretary too? Yes. Get to the finish line. Go. You're in the middle of a Get forward. Good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. He's going fast there. Yeah, now he's moving. You're the driver. Switch your whip to the inside hand, first of all. Back to you. There you go. Lean back, toes up, keep them walking. I know you did. You were confident, that's okay. Keep that confidence and go again. Ready, set, canter. Spank him on the shoulder. That's a lovely canter. He's got the wrong lead, but I want you to canter for a minute. I wanted you to keep going so that you could notice the difference. <laughs> what a really nice seat you did there. Great. I'm gonna ask him at the corner if this is badly. This is his rough lead, he has a hard time getting it. Good, right heel and kiss and canner. Be confident and go. We're not young, still drunk in love. Oh, I got you, there's no reason. Slow him down, pull him to the wall. So, when you ask him here, you're going to give him a tap on the shoulder while you squeeze with your outside heel. Go ahead. There we go. Drop your shoulders into your pockets. Kiss, 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 kiss. We're not stopping at the gate. Who's the driver here, Missy? That's not me to catch the muscles are cramping up in my butt and groin. Whether he's there or whether he's not. Good Canter on. Storm. Fine, yes, again. Storm. Do the bunny hop.
Got no strength now. <laughs> I think you just need to camera up the wall without leaning into your stirrup. It's going. Now put your weight in both feet. Bend your knees and grip with your thighs. Good. And walk. Elbows back. <laughs> and give a big pat. She almost fell off. I know. <laughs> All right, Sophie's been taking pictures of her horse. I had such a good lesson, such a good lesson. I almost fell, but I'm telling you now, if I ever fall, it's gonna be like Kaylee. I'm gonna be like a monkey and hold on and tighten everything up all the way down so that it's just like a little tiny fall. Ah. You wanted to get a picture of her jumping? Mm -hmm. Oh, I love that one. That's a, that's a good one. Okay, look at sore. Okay. All right. All right, it's supper time. Dun, da, da, da. Storm has his blanket on, his new winter, not his new one, he got this one. Do you guys remember, this is the blanket that Storm had when Gabby got him. It's, Gabby picked it out for him. The day, the night that he came to our barn. Yeah. Um, the, day, the day of the night that he came to our barn. Um, I got that yeah. blanket. Yeah, that's his birthday blanket. Yeah. That's his birthday blanket? Yes, it's his birthday blanket. And dun da da da. You guys probably can't tell the difference, but that's, oops. That is Stella's medium weight blanket. It's kind of wintry now. I, we had to put it on the old fashioned. Yeah, it's a little bit thick, a little bit warm. It's thick and warm. I don't know why it is. Oh, this is for like a hood. Yeah, for like a nap. Flap. She's having supper and she's happy. I'm bringing Storm's raincoat home to reattach the leg straps and the butt flap if I can. La, 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 la.